what is up you guys so i'm literally sitting at my desk right now going over numbers making sure like all of my sales look good planning out the rest of this month and next month um because you guys know like if you're in business and things like that um you want to be a little little ahead of the game as far as like your sales your uh you always want to make sure what holidays are coming up so you can make sure you're staying current with your, with your sales and all that good stuff so so far so good and if you guys are wondering what i'm looking at i have like this huge planning book and this book literally has my life in it um and basically it just has all of my important dates projects all that good stuff that i'm working on 2000 18 has been a crazy journey for me as far as entrepreneurship and what not um so i definitely was planning certain things for 2019 that i wanted to accommodate i wanted to look more into wanted to you know do and so much more like i want to have so many more photo shoots in 2019 than i did 2018 and i want to have uh, more sales i want to be current with the sales because i'm not gonna lie uh the holiday usually on holidays is where you offer like specials and sales and all that good stuff so i definitely want to be a little more on top of that because as you guys know like you know i run a lord 96 i run all of my orders getting them out the door responding to customers answering the phone like i am extremely hands-on with my business just because i have trust issues and if you're a business owner you know exactly what i mean when i say trust issues with putting people in charge of certain things so i just kind of like to do it myself so i can get it out the way make sure it's done to my liking and stuff so again i do overwhelm myself a lot as far as um getting everything done or trying to get everything done accordingly so that is what i'm working on now but i really just wanted to jump on here and talk to you guys a little bit about your sales and your holiday sales because that's what's popular currently currently we have like black friday going on we've got christmas coming up new year's um cyber monday so there's a lot of sales that need to be put in place ahead of time so that you don't have to worry about them on the day of and you can launch them uh, as soon as possible and so forth so what i was doing currently was getting my thanksgiving sale put into the computers and stuff um uh, but what something that i want you guys to look out for when you are doing sales and like it's a thanksgiving sale black friday sale and then cyber monday sale and i wanted to since i didn't do it last year i wanted to do all three of them now for your business you don't have to do all three sales but um for me i definitely wanted to do it for one to say i did it to see if i like it for uh the next uh future years and so forth um so so far so good i've got all my sales down pack i have them all written down especially so next year i can always look back and see what exactly i did so always make sure you're organized with your business um, make sure that everything is annotated everything is in a book that you can easily go back through and see what was going on my book is kind of like it's all over the place pages are coming out like it's so much going on so uh due to the due to the reason um being that this sale will be out um it'll be out by the time you guys see this video uh, i'm just going to tell you what my thanksgiving sale is i'm just going to go ahead and tell you guys what my thanksgiving sale is uh so i was teetering between having 25 percent off my entire website or 30 percent off and the reason i kind of teetered between the two was because i was like i want to give a good deal and i want to give good sales and things like that because ultimately when you have amazing sales that's going to bring in more traffic people are going to talk about you more and don't mind my cat back there but when you have good sales people are going to talk about you more people are going to uh go to your website more things like that so you always want to make sure you have good sales but you don't want to lose out on too many too much money during your sales you still want to make sure that you're profiting your business is profiting and things like that the purpose of these sales is to get get large lump sums of orders uh but 
ultimately at the end they kind of balance each other out because you got more sales which means more orders which means you're dealing with more money um verse you know you're only getting your normal amount of sales a day and you're just like plateauing and staying current uh with everything uh so my biggest thing was if i'm gonna have three sales back to back which would be my thanksgiving sale my uh black friday sale and my uh cyber monday sale i didn't want them to overlap each other and i wanted them to be a little different um so i'm not gonna tell you guys what my black friday or what my, my cyber monday sales are just yet because i'm not sure if i want to tweak them but when i tell you the sales get better so like it starts at thanksgiving and for thanksgiving i'm gonna have 25 percent off my entire website which means lashes everything like everything 25 percent off Um, and then, uh, and that's going to be on Allure 96. Um, but then of course, like it starts at 25% off, but then of course, like as, uh, Black Friday comes around and then as Cyber Monday comes around, they get even better. So, um, I definitely am using this kind of like a trial process this year so we'll see how it goes but yeah when you're coming up with sales i want you guys to look at your competition i want you guys to see what they're doing i want you to see how their prices are i want you guys to monitor what you can take as a loss and what you can't because ultimately ultimately when you're having these sales you're cutting your money in half you're cutting 10%, you're cutting 15% off of the money that you would put in your pocket. So one thing's for sure, make sure you can afford to do nice sales. And then two, um, make sure that your sales are, are good, are good enough that you, you will get those extra sales and promotion, good stuff. Uh, so like an idea for a sale. Now I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to do the sale, but I'm just going to help you guys and put this out there. A good idea for like a Cyber Monday sale would be the first 10 people gets 40 bucks off or the first five people gets $100 off their order. And that'll create that urgency in your brand so that people are like, oh, at 12 o'clock, 12 a.m. on Monday, I know I need to be on such and such as website ordering this so I can get this much off. Uh, you can even do that for Black Friday because when you think about it, like Walmart, Best Buys and other stores uh, similar to those, they have sales like that. Like they'll only have maybe 10 60 inch TVs for $300. And once those are gone, those are gone. But that creates the urgency and that creates like uh, people like coming out, standing outside all night, trying to get their hands and trying to be... Um, you know trying to get that particular deal so continue to look into that this video is more of like a vlog more chill a lot of you guys um want me to do more videos like this where i'm literally just in the house working today mainly on uh future projects uh getting the sales going and that's really it um i'm in my pjs basically <laughs> um and, and that's all that's going on. I have my hair tied up, of course, because I'm not doing anything. But if you guys are interested, this is the platinum bundles. I have a wig. So I have a wig on just to like keep everything nice and laid. I have my scarf on just so I don't mess anything up. I'm bare faced today. I don't have my glasses on today. But um, I do. I have a lot of stuff to get done. I need to record today. I have a lot of stuff going on. But one thing I do want to say before I get off this video, I definitely want to say make sure you guys have a nice journal, whether it's on electronically or as I have like a big book full of stuff. Make sure you guys have something to plan out what is going on with your business in your life. Um, so particularly this book is my personal life and also my business, more so my business. But there are certain dates in here that are, uh, you know, as far as like my appointments for uh, the baby and things like that. I have that stuff in here just so I don't over, you know, forget. And then I also keep my calendar in my phone running properly as well with proper dates in there as well. But I definitely want to say being organized is super key. Uh, so something that I am interested in showing you guys is how I kind of like organize my drawers as far as like my business goes and showing you how I label everything. So if you guys are interested in a video like that, uh, let me know because that could be my next video. 
and let me know if you guys want to see how I kind of stay organized as far as like you know getting my labels printed as far as um being organized with my youtube my youtube stuff my uh, webinar stuff all that good stuff because everything is labeled everything is where it needs to be because when a customer <laughs> when a customer calls you and you need to pull up tracking numbers invoices all that good stuff you need to make sure that you know exactly where everything is you need to make sure you're uh, saving your receipts and stuff for tax time all that good stuff so if you guys kind of want to know how i stay organized as far as um labeling uh keeping paperwork in order uh also like um with keeping everything organized in my calendars things like that let me know and i can do that but i do hope you guys enjoyed this little video this video is kind of what am i going to call this like a sales video i guess um where you guys kind of sat with me and went over some little sales that i have going on if you are not aware my thanksgiving sale starts right now right now right now uh so definitely go ahead head over to allure 96 if you want to rock some allure 96 hair this hair is amazing it's done me amazing um this for for one this particular um platinum hair i've been rocking for a long time because it's a wig so i can just take it on and off as i please and it it's amazing so check it out i do have tons of new wigs and stuff on the website so go check that out too um yeah that's it that's all i've got for you guys right now we'll see what other videos um i'll be coming out with today but i do have some juicy videos coming um where is it where is it i do have some oh here it is i do have some juicy videos coming for you guys because i've been uh I'm, i plan on doing a pricing your hair update because i have one on my channel but it's a little outdated so i definitely want to update it for you guys um if i have a video coming on if you haven't gotten your first sale things you're probably doing um wrong that you need to change so i will be coming out with that too a vendors um how to find a vendors update all that good stuff so stay tuned for all of that but i love each and every one of you guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you guys like these little like vlog style videos let me know and yeah that's really it that's all of that <laughs> bye